Hello guys, this is Plavel Oskorov from Laravel Daily Team, team of freelance Laravel developers who are trying to also educate the market and share our knowledge about Laravel and successful projects. Topic of today is one package review, quick review, just a simple case. Uh, pretty popular, pretty recent but pretty popular package, Eloquent has many deep. So you know in Eloquent there is a relationship has many, right? And maybe not everyone knows, but there is has many through relationship, which allows you to uh, tie two uh, tables together. So, for example, one user has roles, and roles has many permissions. Uh, so you can do users has many through permissions and get the relationship all permissions by user. So that comes default from Laravel. And what this package does, it allows you to have unlimited relationships however many uh, layers deep and by default this is the typical scenario so uh, for example you have country which has users which has posts which has comments and you want to have comments by country so this is how you define it use the package use the trade and then you can do this and this is exactly what I've done on a simple project uh, generated with quick admin panel so I have countries every country has users uh, every user has projects and every project has transactions, whereas transactions has many, project transactions, so this one. So it's kind of the same uh, and I want to calculate how many transactions or what is the total amount of transactions per country. So country, user, project, transaction. And the way I did it with the package, I've done composer require and this is how it works. So I add this. Then I add this trait, uh, and this is uh, the relationship. So transactions has many deep transactions. Then you define the intermediate models, so uh, via user and via project. And then for each of them, you define the column if it's different. By default, this is optional. So uh, in my case, it's different. It's owner ID, not user ID. Uh, so I've defined all three. And in controller, you can do this, basically country with transactions, get. And then in the blade, you can do just this country name, in my case, and this is what I've added. And this is the visual result in my browser. So on top of country, there's amount, some amount of transactions for country. This is how it looks in the database, so amount of transactions, and transaction has only project ID, then project ID, if we go to project, project has owner ID, which is user, and every user has a country. So three levels deep, and on top of default eloquent, you can specify this relationship with the package has many deep. It has many more functions, like belongs to many. It can work with belongs to many, even with polymorphic relations. And I didn't try that because I, I would uh, spend more time just to reproducing the situation. Uh, also belongs to and some more stuff. So you can specify default values, default uh, nullable values if the relationship doesn't exist. Pivot data. So documentation, by the way, is really good. And my advice to you, if you are creating packages, documentation is really crucial for anyone to to actually adopt the package. Because if there were no documentation, I wouldn't be shooting this video, right? I would fail to actually uh, try the simplest case. Uh, and a lot of stuff, including actually soft deleting with trash. So a lot of this stuff. Uh, package is really well maintained. Only one issue, and with a lot of closed issues. So Author is really active. Uh, karma points to him. Uh, and yeah, that's that's it. That's quick review uh, of how you can achieve unlimited uh, amount of depth in the relationships with this package. Hope it was helpful. Subscribe to the channel and see you guys in other videos.